Okay guys, here we are again with some more Resident Evil 4. Uh, in the last day episode... What the heck was... Anyways. Uh, in the last episode, we bowed Del Lago and took care of some villagers as well. Del Lago being the alligator. So, yeah, here's some more cutscenes for you guys. been six hours since our last transmission. I was starting to get worried. Don't you mean lonely? Anyway, I started to feel dizzy, and then I guess I must have lost consciousness. Lost consciousness? Maybe that has some connection to what the village chief was talking about. Hmm. Can't say. But I'm all right now. I'm going to continue my mission. Alrighty. Uh, that was weird. He had a weird dream about some insects in him. Wait, there's an important item hidden in the falls. If you are able to get to it, you might be able to get Ashley out get Ashley out of the church. But I'll warn you the route to the church isn't a walk in the park by any means. They deployed what's called El an El Gigante, which in Spanish terms El is the and Gigante is giant. So God bless about what's going on in your body. If I could help, I would, but unfortunately it's beyond my power. Hmm. Who's this letter from? I guess it doesn't really say. So, yeah, we got some news about how to get to Ashley. Since, um... Oh, we haven't got anything to open that door yet. I'm guessing our uh, one person's letting us know there is a way of doing that. So we'll do this because we don't want to sit through cutscenes again. And we'll go through here. Uh, what the heck? Okay. So there's a thing about this. You go through there to continue with the story. You are over here where you left off. This is the big lake. And here's the path back to the church. If you want to go the way you came, but the door will be locked still. And what's that? I thought that was like a shark or something. Um, so there is a turbo button. I don't remember. Nope. Guess not. Oh no, that's the rising of five. Okay. So here's what looks like something for it. In here we have blue fire, which usually intends you guess it, the merchant. Um we don't have anything important. Oh right, right, we do. We get where do you get all this art how do you get all the way out here? That's the thing. Got some rare things uh, on so what you selling? You... The Elegant Mask, we haven't got anything for it, so we're leaving that in this alone. Uh, the Antique Pipe sells for 10000 so we'll do that. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. Okay, here's another interesting <laughs> fact. If you have green, red, and yellow, you can sell it for 10000 as well. But, unless if you have your health all the way full, I wouldn't be doing that. What are you buying? Um, shotgun and 
The only ones you should be upgrading at this moment are the TMP and the Punisher if you really wanted to. The TMP, I don't... I don't know, the Punisher... I don't know. Something, 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 something. Because I don't remember what I was going to say. Um, is there shootables here? I thought there was like a torch or something. Uh, here's this. And here's a box. As Resident Evil 2 logics go, you can push the box. Okay, Resident Evil 1 logics. But whatever. Um, let's see. Okay. Oh, there's a torch right there. Yep. We'll get that in a second. And I thought the dog was done barking, but apparently he wanted to keep barking. Oh, we got a green gem. Which. Uh, what's this? I'll look down. Okay. Yeah, there's a ladder here. For some reason, we can get. Take some rifle ammo. Apparently, we can't take anything else. We can talk to him behind here. But. Yeah, I mean, it'd be nice to take some of this. But. Nope. Apparently not. So that's a little interesting thing you could do there. Uh, the thing that dropped, and there's another torch here. Uh, actually, I don't think anything did drop. Oh, it's been all dropped, okay. Um, let's see, we'll put the herb right here, whatever. Um... Flash grenade, we're really going to hold on to those. Uh, let's put these there. This, 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 this. Over here, exchange that. Uh, whoa. Oh yeah, he has a bigger chest, doesn't he? Where is he? Um, does he have an upgraded? One or did I buy that? What are you buying? Okay, I did buy it. All right, we'll be getting some more bigger chests and later on. Um, I don't know if I have anything else to say about this. We're gonna go trigger a cutscene really quick and then go back to where we were just at. So if you decide you want to go back over here for whatever particular reason, other than not press Y. Oh, right, right, that's what I was going to do. The green gem. I forgot about that. Sorry, you guys. Give me one second about this. You combine it with the elegant mask, and now the elegant mask is green. Just interesting. Still, we need three more gems for it. Or two more gems. Okay. So, if you go over here, I believe this is the right spot. Yeah, okay. You're like, okay, we can go this way. Uh, oh, there's ammo in here. Break this. Get some money. That's very good. Pretty good. But why isn't it happening? Nope. Nothing in here. Oh, there it is. Say hello to wolves. I think they're just the evil version of that guy. Run. You can fight them, but they're really annoying to fight. So the easy way of doing this, I think. Hold on. Let's see if they are idiots in order. If you have good aim, oops, lower it, this one there, throw it over to, this is infinite ammo by the way. Nope, missed. 
That takes care of him. There's two more up there if you want to try to lead him down here. Which I'll try doing that real quick. Because I think they do give something. Yeah, usually torches give you stuff. Which will come all the way around and break those. Um, I was already 10 something for this. Okay, whatever. Uh, I thought there were more walls. Okay. Alright, oh, we got killed by the wolf. Yeah. Uh, you can kill them though. Uh, is this after or before I went in there? Okay, it's after. So that's why we're not going over there. <laughs> you can, but you'll be missing a key item if you do. Because you need to go over here anyways for a certain item. Alright. So let's go. Wait. Oh, for some reason I thought this was something different. Oh. Apparently this one has a bonfire going on over there. Uh, is that possible to even get over there? No, get out of the boat, Leon. We're not going for another boat ride. Oh yeah, um, there's fish in there too. See, uh, you can stock up on fish here too. And the dog is barking. Shut up, dog, please. Uh, we'll show him on camera one day. But anyways, uh, where am I going? So anyways, um... Torch. I don't even know what else. Oh, you can stock up on fish and have enough healing items for whatever. Now, here's a new concept of the game vampires, right? That's what you're trying to show off? Oh. Oh, well. Hello there. Yeah, their heads will start. Well, they won't start breaking off, but you have to be careful about shooting them in the head now. Yeah, this one has a knife ability, a scythe kind of blade ability. That to a new concept. See, this one drops some good things. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's how you know they break off because their head will just, they won't just die. You could either kill with a sniper or you can use the flash grenade, which I will show that off in a second after I have to turn Northern security alerts, so I don't care. Um, this probably gives me something. Do these torches not give me anything? Or um, go up here, go over here, anything important, this. I'm tired of wasting, uh, I think they give you stuff on normal. That might be what the case is. So anyways, uh, flash grenades and shots to the head usually take care of them. Those versions at least. We will be introduced to some more versions after we get further, way further in the game. Uh, I didn't check there was anything there. There's a lot of me on. Now, here's a little interesting thing they got people over here. There we go. Uh, we did careful. Um, okay. What time on this? Okay. You. Oh, I almost jumped down without handle bullets. Okay, so there's water, and your enemies are required to jump. 
over these um, certain stuff. So if you do this, and let's see, there's one. I think I want that one. Or not. Anyways, um. Yeah, it might be annoying for me to use pistol a lot, but yeah, there's no reason to really switch between shotgun and pistol the whole time. Oh yeah, if you didn't notice, uh, if you were playing as regular costume Leon, you'd have like a belt light for whatever reason. Or not belt, not for whatever reason for a belt light because it's dark. So you pull this and that's good. Water starts going somewhere else. So what does that mean exactly? They have a path behind the waterfall. Wait, I guess the dam would make sense. And hello entrance. But something's up with that entrance. We only bowed one enemy this whole time. Why isn't there anyone else? Oh, there you are, guys. I'm starting to miss you. So you jump across here. Yeah, this goes crazy here. I mean, if you want treasures from these guys, go ahead and fight them on the map, but that's probably the best way of dealing with them. Oh, wait. Let's check it. And that takes care of that. And we're going to reload this. Simple way of taking care of them. When they're jumping, just shoot them, which will make the game register as them falling in the ocean. Oh, lake. Which this lake, I guess, leads to Del Lago's lake. So, uh, I don't need help at the moment. And there's a jewel right there. Amber ring. Um, I don't know if there's anything special to do with it. I think you just sell it. I hope that there's some value to it. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's just the ring. That's good because we can get. We would be glad to get some more money. Um, and here's the round of Signia, which unlocks this, and I think it... I've obtained an object that resembles occult groups insignia. Wonderful, Leon. Head back to the church. Ashley's safety is our immediate priority. Yep, we have to go save her, but um, I thought that, I don't even know. It's gonna say resets the waterfall, or whatever. Also, fun fact, if it has white text, if something has white text, then it means that it won't trigger a loading sync screen to go through, but if it has green text, it means you have to, I was trying to load the next area. You saw there, I was getting the spin all though. And here's a boat. And I spent most of the episode talking about the lake. Isn't that wonderful? Anyways, there's no harpoons on this boat, sadly. Well, actually, no, there's a bunch right there. But Leon can't use them. So, we're gonna end this episode off by talking to Mr. Merchant here. Got a selection by of selling off selling. the. not the Beerstein or the Elegant Mask. Ah, we'll sell the Amber I and. 
Thank the two spindles. Is that all? <laughs> okay. Thank um, you. What are you buying? Anything else you have for me that I want? Now we'll get a better scope. Uh, oh, there's what a rocket launcher buying? though. Um, yeah, I think you probably blow out the boulder of this, but we'll pick this up later when it comes into more of a use. Just save up your money because you're usually going to be buying rocket launchers. Take care of random stuff. So, other news. This is the end of this episode, and I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I did. And see you guys next time.